We are talking the 149th Preakness Stakes Saturday at Pimlico in Greater Baltimore. Eddie Olchek joins us here on the program. Edzo, what do you see happening? How does this race shake out with the scratch and move? Things are a little bit different early and maybe late as well. Yeah, well, it's great to be with you, Jeremy. Um, I, I mean, I look at the speed of this race. At least I think the speed of the race is going to come from the outside, the other Bob Baffert, and I guess the only mm-hmm. Bob Baffert now right. uh, with imagination on the on the outside. Uh, really was a game second uh, in the Santa Anita Derby. And, and I think the other speed in the race, I mean, call me crazy, I mean, I think it's going to be D. Wayne Lucas is number six, sees the gray. I know he's got mm-hmm. two in there and he's got the seven, just steel. Um, I think being so close in that last race, going to pad day mile, Jeremy, yeah. uh, 22, 44, 109. And the horse was no more than two lengths out of it at any time. And it eventually won. I, I actually like that horse. I picked that horse underneath. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to come up with the gimmick, but the horse went mm-hmm. off at a really nice nine to one. So I think the speed of the race, as far as I'm concerned, is the six horse sees the gray and the nine imagination. Where does the end Tuscan, where does the eight Tuscan goal kind of fit gold tip, you know, kind of fit into everything. Mm-hmm. Um, Mystic Dan won't be too far off. So I think we're going to get, I think we're going to get a lively pace, even though Muth is out of it. Right. And then do the closers have a shot in this when you're looking at, you know, catching freedom horses like that from the yeah. back of the pack and they make yeah. them run. Yeah, that's that's my plan. At least that's what I'm thinking. Anyways, now I, I think that, um, yeah, I feel that imagination will be hanging around. Again. But I do believe is that I think the pace will be hot enough. And, mm-hmm. uh, and, and you're going to look for a horse that's maybe in that mid pack or if they do go overly quick, maybe get a horse to pick them all up. So, yes, I, I think that the uh, the pace will come back. Uh, kind of like it did in a derby, so to speak, right? right? Like, I mean, Mystic Dan was sitting the perfect trip and got the trip up the rail and, and beat the closers home. So I, I think a very similar type of uh, style on how this, uh, how this Preakness Stakes is going to run. All right. We'll see how it shakes out on Saturday just after 7 o'clock.